welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I thought it would be fun to do a sewing video but this is so beginner friendly so if you've maybe seen my like easy sew cushion video or the drawstring bag video this one is just as simple. This is also scrap fabric friendly so if you have some fabric scraps which we all do and we all have stashes that we just don't want to throw out then you can use this for this DIY and make some pretty little fabric hangers. Let's get straight into the video but before I do, do make sure you have hit the subscribe button so you have subbed to my channel and you can see how I made these hangers. The first thing I did for this DIY was I measured out my hanger and I made a template. So you can just get any old wooden or plastic hanger and roughly trace out a template using your hanger as a guide and then you can make it as long or as short as you want. I also just like to give my fabric an iron so it's nice and crease free before I use it. I just pinned on my template and I'm just cutting it off with a fabric scissors. So I am just ironing a small hem to the top piece. You're gonna have two pieces of fabric. This hem is for your hanger, so the metal part of your hanger is gonna peep through. So you're giving this a hem so that the fabric won't fray on you. So I just folded it over, ironed it, folded it again, and then I just done a tiny straight, straight, straight stitch across. I'm now just cutting out a piece of fabric. I'm just using some scraps and I'm cutting out a pocket. So I'm adding a pocket to my fabric hanger. A pocket is great because you can pop in, maybe you have a certain dress that needs, you know, bra straps or tights, you can pop in the little pocket. So I'm just ironing the three corners. I'm also gonna hem the top as well. You'll see how I do it. And then I'm gonna stick it on to the center of my hanger. I am just gonna find the center on the front part and then I'm gonna pin it on with some pins and then I'm gonna sew it all the way around. Obviously not the top where your hem is because you don't wanna sew your pocket clothes but I have done that in the past so if you do, don't worry, I have also made that mistake. I am just trimming up any loose threads. So you are gonna place the two right sides together and you are going to sew around. I left putting a hem on to the end. This is just so your hem will be the right kind of length the whole way around. So two right sides together and then take it to the machine. I am just snipping the edges of the fabric so anywhere where there is a curve this is just so when you turn it inside out the fabric is going to sit better you can also iron your seams flat at this stage as well so I then just folded over the fabric and I added a hem I folded it over once ironed it folded over it for a second time ironed it and then I took it to the machine and gave it a nice even hem Once 
Once you are finished sewing, you can turn everything right way out, trim your whiskers and give it one last iron before popping it onto your hangers. I hope it was as easy, I hope I made it look easy to follow because it can be hard trying to film and sew at the same time. I love the fabric hangers because they're actually one of the first things I learned to make when I, I had done sewing classes when I first learned to sew. Um, I'm actually going to put the Instagram here for my sewing teacher. I haven't done a sewing class in years. Um, but basically Mary got me started with sewing and one of these was... Um, like she taught me how to make one of these. I've seen them also, I have one or two sewing books as well. Um, but I just think they're a fun idea and you can add a little pocket or if you don't want a little pocket. The pocket's good, especially if you have dresses that you need, like maybe bra straps or certain tights um, and you wanna pop them into the little pocket. So it is quite fun, you can customize this. You could actually even add some embroidery as well. So I don't know, maybe these could be like a fun wedding present jewelry sometimes people have like personalized hangers or something you could maybe just add embroidery to the front pocket and um, if you wanted to personalize them that's it for this week as i mentioned earlier in the video i also have some other easy so uh, beginner friendly sewing videos because i know it can be hard in the beginning when you're starting to sew things you're like what can i make so I'll pop them on the end of this video at the end screen and I'll pop those videos in there. Please give this video a cheeky thumbs up if you enjoyed it and also sub to my channel if you are new and I will catch you in next week's video. Bye everyone!